the theme for tonight's game is Salute to Service. Where we are honoring the many men and women who have given service to our country um, and defended our liberty. Um, and so it is our way of honoring, giving back to those who have given us so much. When I was uh, 18, I went off to West Point and Military Academy, did four years of school there, and then I served five years in the Army. As, uh, last year, I got out of the Army and came back to ASU to pursue graduate school in the W.P. Carey School of Business, getting my MBA. And uh, this year, I was selected as the fifth class of the Tillman Scholars. I actually was prompted to apply when I did. Um, my brother passed away uh, early in the year in 2012 and he had always told me to do it and he was a big Pat Tillman fan and so after he passed away I decided that it was probably time to go ahead and apply. Uh, so I applied and was selected in 2012 for the fourth class of Tillman Military Scholars and my scholarship will follow me all three years in law school. Being part of the Pat Tillman Foundation is incredible because it's, it's a group of people who are just in and of themselves absolutely amazing and then as a group they're even more amazing. It's, it's an incredible organization. Arizona State has a really, really rich history and tradition associated with the military, um, especially some of our former student athletes. Everything from John Goodman, who was a commander of the Marine Forces in the Pacific, all the way to one of our current players, Jake Sheffield. But we all know the story about Pat Tillman, who gave his life in Afghanistan serving our country. So we have a long, rich history and tradition uh, at Sun Devil Athletics tied to our military. ASU and the other 15 schools have gone above and beyond what other schools are doing to assist their, their military members and their veteran members um, by offering special programs and, and things of that nature so that they've, they've made a commitment to actually further what they're doing for their veterans as well and the Pat Tillman Foundation has recognized them because of that. Through a program through the Veterans Tickets Foundation, also known as Vet Ticks, we were able to give thousands upon thousands of tickets um, to former veterans and current active duty military who are serving our country. It's our way of giving back and thanking them for everything that they have done for us. And our fans reached out and the athletic department was able to match ticket for ticket the tickets that were donated by our fan base. I've been to every Sun Devil game for the last couple of years since I got out of school. So uh, never been on the field before. That was really, really fun. Uh, definite honor, uh, really nervous, heart was pumping when they announced my name on the Jumbotron. So that was, that was really fun. Though. Sergeant Bryce Pearson was a native of Arizona by birth and a Sun Devil by choice. The Pearson family have been longtime season ticket holders and longtime supporters of Sun Devil Athletics and Arizona State University. Unfortunately, their son tragically lost his life in service of their country overseas. Um, tonight, we will be able to surprise them where he was unfortunately just four credit hours short of gathering his degree at Arizona State. Tonight, we will be granting him his degree and we will be presenting the diploma to his family this evening. It's an interesting feeling to be on the field with so many people who are supporting you and supporting ASU and the ROTC people are there so it's sort of a, you get both sides of it, it's the people who have made the decision to join the military and are sort of beginning their military career and then those of us who are already done with it on the field together and it's, it's sort of, it's, it's a really neat thing to know that you're sort of on the outside and they're on the inside and it's just a neat feeling.